up, bodybuilding fans? It's Monday here at Muscle in the Morning, and I'm Dave Palumbo, and today is Monday, June 25th, 2018. Let's find out what's going on in the world of bodybuilding and fitness. The good artists know how to stand back, look at their work, and figure out what they need to do to make it better. So I guess that must make Milan Shotik some kind of new age iron artist. Last week, the former 212 Olympian told RX Muscle that he was planning to take the rest of the season off to focus on making improvements, and that he's eyeing the 2019 New York Pro as his next potential landing spot. Last month, we saw Shotik and his crew roll out what was easily the best overall look of his career at the New York Pro, where he managed a top eight finish in the open division behind some of the biggest names in the sport. So with another year of seasoning under his belt and some more time to focus on honing his craft, a top five finish is definitely within striking distance. You don't need to go on one of those YouTube deep dives to find out if monsters really exist somewhere out there in the world. All you need to do is pick up your phone and jump on Michael Lockett's Instagram page. Over the weekend, we saw one of the scariest men in the game release a handful of new updates as he barrels ahead towards his crash course with the Windy City. Heading into this year's Chicago Pro, it almost feels like last year's champ is a forgotten man because of all the Sergio Oliva and Justin Rodriguez hype sucking all the oxygen out of the room. Even at Lockett's best, he's going to have a tough time defending his title with this kind of firepower in the lineup. But who knows? Maybe going in there as the underdog will end up being a blessing in disguise because we all know that an underestimated Michael Lockett is a very dangerous Michael Lockett. Now that the World Cup is in full swing, I know just about every Brazilian on the planet is completely dialed in to what's going on with their football team right now. But hopefully between all the hooting and hollering, they can take some time out of their day to show some love to their very own men's physique standout, Felipe Franco. Over the weekend, Franco and his team released an official update 12 weeks out of their latest Olympia campaign, where they gave their fans a quick glance at what they're bringing to the party in Vegas. Franco snagged his Olympia bid by bringing his best look ever to the LA Championships, where he dominated from wire to wire. So if they can manage to hit the Olympia stage with a few improvements and that same level of focus, there's a definite opportunity there for him to compete for a slot in the top 10. There comes a point in life where all the sweat, all the hard work, and all the preparation is finally done. And then it all boils down to one thing. Will you be able to execute? And a few weeks from now, we'll all find out firsthand if rookie big man Seth Shaw is ready to execute. Over the weekend, the Shaw cam dropped some clips from a few recent training sessions that show the former North American champ heading into the home stretch of prep for his debut at the Chicago Pro. The lineup at this Chicago show already looks like it's shaping up to be one of the strongest regular season events on the calendar. But on paper, this guy looks like he could be a serious top competitor who could hurt a lot of people's feelings if everything shakes out as expected. And that does it for yet another edition of Muscle in the Morning. I'm Dave Palumbo reminding you to always be true to your passions. And make sure to follow us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram.